this line is wild. Damn, man. I hate getting stuck at... Oh, oh my god. Yeah, yeah, all, all TNFs are gone. And yeah. bags? Four. Four, it's actual. Stamp. Step down. You said I could wear a medium? I can't wear a I'm late for work. Yo, what up guys? Welcome back to another video. Take these out. Today is another highly anticipated Supreme Thursday. This is my second week in a row being blessed with a decent number. Well, last week was the best time I had all season, 10.30 a.m. If I showed up early enough, I could have been number one. That's the best time spot anybody could ever get. This week, not as good as that, but decent. We got 12.30 and basically we're gonna see what we can cop with 12.30. What does the store have left on the Supreme and North Face collab? Pretty expensive retails, so a lot of people have been sleeping, but let's see what we can get. This line is wild. Damn, man, I hate getting stuck at, this ain't gonna be a good week, man. All TNFs are gone. Uh, yeah. Bags. The jacket's left. Right? The jacket's left, right? Oh, bags. There's only black and no green bags. No bags. I mean, black and green jackets. No bags. No bags. Not again. There's a sluggo. They had a. You know, four. Four to that four. Stamp. Step down. All right, guys, so had to put my hood on. It was getting too cold, you feel me? But we out here. We just left the store. Picked up a couple items. I'll show you guys when I get to the crib. Um, damn. No bags. No shoulder bags. No waist bags. No NY reversible uh, puffy jacket, whatever it's called. A couple items they didn't have. I wanted an S logo and natural for the personal. They didn't have that. So I had to get a different color. Couldn't even get my size. Uh, but we made it work. It is what it is. Let's continue with the rest of our day. What? Oh, okay. Yeah, I got a, I got a 1045. Yeah. That's a bad camera. That's a great camera, bro. Who is that? Who's that? Who this? Yikes. Uh, has bad. Mac bar? Go, bro. Good, good jacket. One chopper. Hmm? And the Gore-Tex that came out last week. Nope. It's a good Gore-Tex though. He's the one that go for the high. I don't know, bro. I thought that's the only thing we have. I don't know. The... I don't know, bro. Is that? Oh, that's right there then. Hey, what up, guys? So we're back at the crib, and uh, this guy doesn't know the difference between a router and a modem, like. Do y'all know the difference between a, a modem me, and a... Like, you expect to cook, but you don't know what's the difference between a router and a modem, like... Yo, I, you in I, my I, house, bro. Put some respect I on my name, bro. <laughs> Just static IP, get out of here. I'm about to try this on. No, I don't like crap. Chris, you know why you keep locking him out? Because I don't like him, that's why. Right. Yeah, I hope this fits, bro. It's looking kind of small. On DS, can't sell on StockX anymore. I was still still on StockX, bro. I don't give a dang. That's all right. Yeah, it's the same as the, as the box logo. You said I could wear a medium? I mean, you could wear a large. I can't wear a large. I mean, I can't. You won't be that comfortable, right? All right, guys, so this is the hoodie. 
Thought it wouldn't fit, but it looks looks high, right? He's lying, right? He just said it looks good, right? It looks a little suspect. That's what that S stands for? Suspect? <laughs> Yo, get out, of, get out of my house, bro. Get out of my house. I'm liking this color, man. Wear this with some UNCs, bro. That's a clean fit. Nah, it's like the same. It's the same. I got this the hoodie right here. I'm liking this, bro. I could wear large and XLs, but XLs just fit me more comfortably. But this one's not that bad. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this. I'm gonna keep this. And I got the the sweatpants, but in natural online. Cause I wanted the hoodie, but couldn't get the hoodie. So I don't want the sweats now, cause I want the whole set. So I'm gonna have to sell the sweats. Oh well, this is what it is. Yo, what up, guys? So pretty much that was all the footage that I was able to get for week nine. The highly anticipated Supreme and North Face collab. Just like last year, fall, winter 17, we had two parts of the North Face collab. We had the leather collection, just like we did this season, but instead we had a leather nupsie. And then part two, we had the mountain print jackets like this one right here. This bad boy right here. Now, to me, this was one of the best prints for a parka or nupsie jackets. We had the Bartolo or Baltoro. Bartolo, however you pronounce it, I don't, I don't really know, I don't have that. I feel like this is one of the better prints, you know, we have the leopard, we have the fur, we have the leaves, we have a whole bunch. I feel like this was one of the best ones in my opinion because it's just so different. Like, who has a jacket, you know, blend into a freaking mountain, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I'm really feeling this jacket and I've definitely worn this thing to the ground. I can't wait for it to get a little colder here in New York just so I can bring it back out again. So we had two parts last year, we had the nupsies that came out first that were leather, we had like black, red, and then the yellow colorway I believe it was. And it's not until just now that the price for those has really gone up. So it's kind of like if you invested money into the leather parkers that came out this week, they will go up. Just, just you're just gonna have to wait a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I was able to pick it up in store. They only had black left by the time I got inside. When Chris got inside the store, he had number 1130 or 1145 or something like that. He had an early time slot and all they had left was green and black. They had no royal, they had no red, they had no bags, no waist or shoulder bags. That's insane, they had nothing like that at an early time, you know what I'm saying? So to me, that's insane. I don't really know why so many people were really going after this, especially since like the retails were pretty high up, you know what I'm saying? They were really high priced. And I guess that's kind of like even more of a reason for people to sleep on it, especially like the Parker jackets. Like those sat online for a little while. Had it, had it been like that Parker jacket or even like the Nupsy, it would have flew within like 10 seconds, 15 seconds, just because of the fact that it is a little high priced, but it's more affordable and it has a higher resell probability. Like you can you can actually like, there's a higher chance that you, you'll make a lot of money off of it. With the leather jacket, it's gonna take some time for you to be able to do that. But I did pick it up and I already sold it. So I'm not gonna be able to show you guys what, you know, how it looks and stuff like that. And you know, like all the compartments, even though it's pretty much the same as that Parker jacket, it's just all leather. I did pick it up and I sold it recently so I, I'm, I apologize I can't show you guys it's not Thursday by the way it's Saturday so this video is going up a little later so it's Saturday so I had two days already so I already I already sold the jacket you know what I'm saying but from what I was able to pick up once I got inside the store was the S logo hooded sweatshirt in the royal blue colorway this is one of the more hyped up colors of the season you know every season we have a special hyped up color like it's definitely the royal blue because of like the cat in the hat hoodie that came out and you know we also have like that terracotta colorway that's been very hyped up as well like we have certain colors and you know you can look at the box that was coming out in december it's gonna have a royal blue so you know that one's gonna fly off natural is another hyped up color which is definitely one of the things i wanted from this drop was the natural s logo hoodie which i was not able to get online but i did get the sweatpants in large in the natural colorway but it's like no point in me keeping that because i want the whole set so I'm, I'm gonna get rid of it, so you know what I mean? But I did get this in store. And when I got inside the store, they had like the green, the gray, the brown. And you're probably wondering why I get this color instead of like the dark green, because I know that was another hyped up color because it kind of has like the Gucci vibes, it's all green. But I like this color. I personally like this color and I'm glad that I got this. And I wasn't really sure how this was gonna fit me since it's a large, I usually wear XLs and Supreme hoodies. Here's a picture of me wearing it. And I feel like it actually looks really good. As you guys saw in the previous clip, you know, it actually fits me and stuff like that. So I, I'm definitely gonna keep it. I will be selling that, you know, the sweatpants though, because I, I I don't have the natural hoodie. So I don't want the natural sweats. And then I have like the blue one, there's no reason. So I'm getting rid of that. So if anyone's interested, you can DM me on Instagram, Twitter, right here at IMGC Kicks, or you can email me, which is down below in the description. So just, just look for that. You can hit me up, you can work out a deal. I did get the leather parka, like I said, but I already sold that. And then I also picked up the the red pilot marker. Um, this came out last week, week eight. I picked up the black one, which is right here. 
and I didn't know that you can get both in store. I did not know that until my boy Chris told me. He was like, yo, I got both of them in store. They let me get them. I was like, damn, I didn't know that. I'll probably use them at some point. Obviously not right now. I really have no need for it. But it's just something cool to have. It's a cool, it's a cool cheap accessory. Why not? You know what I mean? That's pretty much it, guys, for the pickups. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit that red button right there. Subscribe, be a part of the team. We're very close to 25,000 subscribers. We'll, we'll be hitting it very soon. I know we will. Thank you for all your support, guys. Thank you for everything. So with all that being said, this is Chris, GC Kicks. I'm going to catch you guys in the next video. Peace.